Hello vendors, in this video we are going to learn how we can create pop-up menu in MIT App Inventor or we can use this as a sidebar of our app. So how we can create this app? So let me just show you a step by step. So first of all, click, click on a start new project and my project name is pop-up sidebar menu and okay. So that's our first screen here. So I'm going to drag and drop here one layout and that one is vertical arrangement like this and make this one with an height is filled parent like this now make this background color to something tail okay like this or greenery something this one now let me just use some more things here so just drag and drop your one more vertical arrangement here and make this one is also with an height is filled parent like this and make this as a same color okay so just copy that background color done and paste that background color here like this now just drag and drop your one button so just drag and drop that button here okay in the top and just remove that text from here and then use one image here you find your image option click on image click on upload file and click on choose file now you can choose any icon so i'm going to use here that one icon for my new so click on open and then just okay and it's too big so i will make that height and width is in a pixel is like 50 50 to check that it's working fine or not so 50 pixel here also so it's fine okay now what i will do here use here some label so just try and drop that label here and uh, make that text something lorem so i will choose here from text so just copy and paste some text from here and just paste it here and uh, you can use the content like this here and make this one with this fill parent like this so i'm going to remove more text from here like this and now i'm going to use your one image also like this so this should be look like a one simple page so click on picture click on upload file click on choose file and you will get that one image here and then okay and make that height and width of that image is 100, 100 pixel like this okay and make all this thing in a center so vertical is the center this should be horizontal should be center but a vertical is i'm going to make it at uh, top and we will use some adding options also here you can do a lot more thing with this uh, overall content so main purpose of all that that we have to use your menu so we will create multiple vertical arrangement here okay so we have done the vertical arrangement one so i'll just copy and paste one and two times to make one second one it should be like let me just hide that first one here and then hide third one also and in the second one i will make that content is something about us like this you can change that image also or you can change that background color also if you wish okay so i will make that text color should be something orange or should be something yellow like this and and the third vertical arrangement three i will make that disable one and make that vertical arrangement four should be visible and change that content from here to make that label to like uh, contact us something like that and i will put that to contact and number something like that cool so that's that's the overall page okay so what i will do here now i'm going to remove that picture from here like this so we have three page we have one uh, menu option here the menu icon here now just go to the blog section and we have to write a code so before the write the code we need one extension here and that extension called pop up menu okay and that developed by the dev yp i hope so let's use that uh, extension okay so click on that aix file okay and then go to the mit app inventor and now just go to the here extension click on import extension and just drag and drop that extension here and then import it just drag and drop that extension here now go to the block color here okay and now just whenever someone click on the button okay so this button like this so we need to open the menu so click on that menu and you will see here the show pop-up menu like this and the component is like our button okay so i will use your button one 
so like this buttons and now we need to choose your items so we will create one list here so you'll find and make a list like this and just use text here like this so first one is something like you can call home and then second one is like uh, about us and then third one is like contact us like this so i will choose there from the item like this here and make it here but i will make uh, more items here because i need to fill that uh, menu in the left sidebar so i will choose multiple items here but uh, i will choose all these item as an empty okay so you can increase that items here now i will just use here the blank one just copy paste here and click on the, the home page so we have to open our home page whenever someone click on the about us page so we have to open our about us page so how we can do that go to the design and let me just hide that visible one that one and hide that third one and the fourth one or you can um, do one more thing here make it visible off okay like this now you can do one more thing here change you can change that vertical arrangement one name to the home home layout okay home layout and just click on okay and you can change that name also this one is about us about about us layout about layout okay and the third one is like the contact layout contact layout right and okay now let's go to the block section and now we need to hide and show our menu so just go to the here whenever someone click on that whenever someone select some menu suppose someone select the home then click on them and you will find your on menu item click okay this one so so he can you will find that will return the item okay so we have to use here one condition that is control go to the if and just check go to the logic and just equal and the find that the item is selected is equal to the home if the item is selected the equal to the home then we will hide we will display the home layout visible should be true this one this should be true but the another other two layout should be the height height okay visible off so make just them visible false and that make it false like this now we just need to copy paste that all items again like just use your condition like else and then one more time else or sorry you can choose here else if and one more time else if now if the item is equal to the about us page okay about us here you find that we have done about us okay okay make sure that should be as small then we just need to copy paste again layout like this and we just need to make home layout should be false okay and the another one is layout home layout is should be the about layout should be the true but the another one is this one is called contact us layout is should be false but make sure you have to do here also about layout should be false and the contact us should be false and now we just need to copy paste again three times like this just select them like this make that one condition again here just change that to contact what we have done here contact us just copy here like this and just make that home layout should be false and then about is also false but the contact should be the true one like this now we have page where we have menu and we have done the condition of it now let's design let's run this app and let's see how it's work the home screen okay and that's the menu just click on that and you'll find here that is white okay but that's the menu but how can i change that menu color okay text color so go to the block here and uh, you'll find here one option here go to click on that extension and you will see your dev text color or you can change that from the setting you don't need to do the code option also design and you'll see the click on that extension and you'll find your text color you can make that one is black like this let's refresh this and let's see how it's work see home click on home to display home click on about us to show the about us page click on contact us so to show the contact us page so that is the alternative option to create the sidebar in mit app inventor 
So if you need any help on that, so just comment on the video. I'll try my best to solve your problem. Thank you so much for watching this video. Please subscribe my channel, like this video, and share this video. Have a nice day. Be safe. Bye bye.